St. Bartholomew School in Newbury. Here is our presentation on future flight. This is our entry to the BP Ultimate STEM Challenge. We have been investigating the best shape of wing to keep an aircraft in the air for the longest time. The better the wing, the less fuel that needs to be used by the aircraft, improving efficiency, reducing cost and reducing pollution. This is the experiment we used to set up the investigation. We made, a, we made the wings from card and used straws to help them move up and, up and down easily on the wire. We will now demonstrate. We made the experiment a fair test by using the same piece of card for each aerofoil which was 9 centimetres by 18 centimetres. This ensured that we would have but that type would be a fair test. We also made sure that the fan was half a metre away from the wires on which the aerofoils would fly. A wing works because the shape allows air to flow quicker over the top of the wing than it does the bottom. This creates a difference in air pressure on the underside of the wing. Um, the difference in air pressure creates a force on the underside of the wing giving the plane a lift. It showed that if you have a broader front and a uh, flat end helps the air to get underneath and push us up faster because more air can go underneath and push it up. And having a different uh, front helps it because it's not symmetrical and the wind wouldn't split into two and go over equally. It produced steady heat when, even when the power of the fan switch down, turn down. To extend our project further, we would also investigate the angle of the wing and the flow of the air. The position of the straws made a big difference to the wing. I really enjoyed doing this project and we learned tons about how planes fly. Goodbye! Goodbye!